reaction, we're trying to make one butene using a Wittig synthesis. So in a Wittig synthesis, we are making alkenes by joining up the two parts of the double bond. We're going to be reacting a Wittig reagent with a ketone or an aldehyde. So let's take a look at the different possibilities that we have. So we can choose to put the aldehyde, in this case, on the right, and the triphenylphosphine component, which is the Wittig reagent, on the left. So all we've done here is we are working backwards, breaking this double bond, and realizing that we need to put a C double bond O on the right side and a triphenylphosphine on the left. Now the aldehydes are usually commercially available and so one of the reagents that we'll need will be this propanal. The other reagent that we'll need is this Wittig reagent. Now normally we can't purchase the Wittig reagent so we have to make it and we do so always in the same way. We start with an alkyl halide and treat it first with triphenylphosphine followed by n-butyl lithium. And you'll notice that the way that we make the Wittig reagent is pretty straightforward, at least if we're not looking at the mechanism. We are just going backwards, replacing the double bond P53 with an H and a Br. So in any Wittig synthesis, you can always work backwards like this. One of the components will be an aldehyde or a ketone, and the other component will be an alkyl halide. Okay, so is there another way that we can use a Wittig synthesis to make one butene? The other way to look at it is to put the triphenylphosphine group on the right and the ketone or aldehyde on the left. So let's take a look at that. Okay, so in this way, now we have formaldehyde, which will be the carbonyl component, and on the right hand side we'll now have the triphenylphosphine group. And again working backwards, the, this Wittig reagent, okay, which is actually an illid, will be made from bromo, one bromopropane. Again using the same reagents, first triphenylphosphine followed by n-butyl lithium. So there are actually four different compounds that we could use to make one butene using a Wittig synthesis. One of them will be one propane. Another one will be formaldehyde. And we could also use methyl bromide or propanal. And that's basically it.